just like to share that it's been a blessing here coming to these men's events for the last seven years or so since I've been saved and uh, I've seen a lot like today we saw men basically broken we saw men being built up we saw men being encouraged I personally myself was encouraged blessed so many things that happen at these types of events it's it's amazing this is actually where men can learn to be men by godly men learn how to be godly men so many things that the world pumps into us is one of the things that the Lord's been ministering to me lately is that the hardest thing to do is to be a man I mean we're born as males and we think just because we grow up and know how to look at a girl or throw a punch we're a man but that's not what makes us men the Bible says to be a lover of one wife and have your kids have reverence for you to rule your own house well that's hard work that is hard work and I and I know we speak me personally about a revival and a revival being necessary in the lives of the youth today which is true but I think it needs to start in the men honestly the hearts of the men need to step up and be men in their families if, if the women had more leaders and men being men and learning what men actually are there'd be less so many less than the feminist movement probably never would have started because there would have never been a need for a woman to play the male and female role in the house the, the kids would would learn how to love their families I don't know I had so much I wanted to say while I was thinking about what I was gonna say here but I just blessed and, and I just been touched by the work that the church here does because they really have a heart and know how important it is for men to to be men I know I said that about a hundred times but God bless <laughs>